All right, we got into a bit of a debate today, Brock. Almost out of nowhere. It wasn't really part of our show plan. But the idea of Matt Hasselbeck signing for a couple more years, as Tim Hasselbeck told us, could be a possibility, and drafting Jake Locker at the same time. To me, that's a recipe for problems later on down the road. And I say, don't worry. Stop being so stressed. It's the weekend. Don't worry about these things. Don't worry about these things. Sure, there's some diehards out there that have number 10 tattooed on their chest. And they're going to love everything that Jake did for the rest of his life and want him to start the day he signed. I think the majority of fans, football fans, know that Jake's a project. And if the Seahawks deem him worthy of that 25th pick, well, you've got to trust John Schneider and Pete Carroll. And I think most importantly in that conversation, trust that the quarterback room, that the locker room, that the practice field would not be affected by who the fans want and the chanting in the stands and everything yeah, else. Yeah, it does, though. I mean, ultimately, that stuff does trickle down. We've seen it too many times before. And you may be right. There may be fans who understand Jake Locker is a project. But I have not seen too many fans behave rationally when it's come to him before. And that doesn't mean that they're going to, even if they get it, Brock, in yeah. their mind, Matt goes out there, struggles for a couple games, or gets hurt and Locker comes in for a couple People behave very erratically. Even what they tell themselves they might think changes drastically when you actually get put in that situation. It just seems like too big a risk for me, and I just don't get it. I mean, heck, even two radio hosts thought the Seahawks at 8 and 9 were going to beat the Bears. Exactly right. right. It could be a bit irrational. Sometimes even when you know something, you get a little irrational when <laughs> faced with what you've just recently seen. Enjoy your weekend. Enjoy NFL Championship weekend. We'll be back on Monday. Go Packers. Go Pack.